crosshead allows you to use any custom crosshair in any PC game that you want. By default, we turn on desktop crosshair mode, which is the most compatible feature. You can also switch it to full screen mode, which will basically enable the overlay for a lot of full screen games. Today, I'm going to demo it in Borderlands 3. So, I'm going to turn on full screen mode. And as you can see, the status has changed to waiting for game. We're just going to simply go to the game. And after a few seconds, it should appear in game. As you can see, the crosshair has now appeared in game. If we're not satisfied with the crosshair, we can simply just tab out of the game and change the settings. So let's say I want a pink crosshair and I want to make it slightly bigger as well. Now, of course, you may lose some quality if you upscale the crosshair too much. But we're giving you a lot of options here, images to use and pick from. So there's a lot of customization here. Um, let's see. Now, if I tab back into Borderlands now, I'll have the chevron here. Yep. It's all live uh, when you change it. You don't have to restart the game to make any changes. It just simply works. Let's change it to a circle thick. And let's use um, a high contrast color like green. I'm just going to scale it down a little bit. You can, of course, you're welcome to change the offset as well. However, most games this will be pretty pointless in. But it is there if you need to change the offset. At 0, zero which is the default offset, Crosshood will automatically center the crosshair to where it thinks it will fit on the screen. In 99% of use cases, this will work perfectly fine. But obviously, if you're playing a strange game and you need to change the crosshair offset, then you may need to make some adjustments. Fortunately, you can also change the turn the crosshair off using the hotkey system. By default, the hotkey is Control Alt and X, which will turn off the crosshair display. You can press it again that. to enable the crosshair again. It's a toggle system. Thanks for checking out Crosshood, and you can buy it on Steam for $5. We hope you'll find the tool useful.